be honest, I didn't want to get out. <laughs> and uh, they said, ah, it's check and flag, and I was on the back straight, and I said, ah, I just do another lap. But then, oh, unfortunately, the fuel light came on, so I had to come in. Uh, no, I, I really like our new uh, Honda HPD. It's, it's, a, it's a really good car. Uh, it's reacting to everything, you know, what we expect to do and, uh, you know, our muscle milk boys did a very good job. Uh, it, it's it's always tough, you know, building a brand, brand new LMP one, especially if it is the first one on track, um, you know, and, and they they really deserved some, some credit and uh, a big thanks from my side and I think also from the other drivers that, that we made this test and uh, you know, we could get some decent running into it. So I, I'm I'm very happy and uh, I enjoyed myself. Well, it really feels like home. It's, uh, it's a fantastic car as usual. Uh, the the Honda Honda package uh, with the worst uh, worst design is uh, is is then def definitely uh, a fantastic prototype. I think this car is going to surprise a lot of people. Uh, you know, it's probably one of the best sports cars I've driven in my. Uh, my short career, I should say. So uh, yeah, I really had a blast today in Sebring. It's uh, it's got a lot of grip, a lot of downforce, uh, as it always uh, always does on those cars. But uh, you can really feel the DNA uh, of those cars year after year. And I'm really happy. Uh, I'm part of the Muscle Milk team for for this year, 12 hours Sebring. I think uh, we're gonna have a really good package. This is quite special. This is the first time actually that we uh, acquired a brand new car. So um, that's certainly a, a big step for the team also. Uh, the build of the car was um, done in our Benicia race shop. The guys did a tremendous job putting it together, put in a lot of hard work and a lot of hours. So this, uh, I think today was a, a special day for the team. Greg made a decision um, that he would step out of the big car and step out of the prototype car and, uh, and uh, get a little bit more serious about the racing organization and, and him focusing on, on being an owner. And I think... Uh, you know, Greg built a successful business with uh, Cytosport and he certainly knows uh, after 40 plus years in racing how to uh, uh, put it all together into a successful racing operation. So I think you just uh, see a natural progression of the race team, a lot of commitment from the owner obviously and, uh, and our partners and sponsors. And that's uh, obviously a lot of enjoyment and fun. And for me personally, it's uh, obviously great to be involved in, in, in that kind of level. and. Uh, so, I mean, Greg and I became very close friends over the years and uh, it's, it's really fun to, uh, to see uh, that a team chels like this. It's a little bit like uh, when, a, when a baby gets born, although that's even more special. So. Well, last year we only had one day of testing, so it was, a, it was a late call and we didn't get to do much with the car, so we didn't do much setup and the car was actually pretty good in the race. This one is carrying a lot more downforce. It's, uh, as you can see, the splitter is... Uh, it's a brand new uh, design. It's got a little bit, it's creating a little bit more downforce. The turbo also is, is a little bit higher in the front, so it's the efficiency is much better. It has less drag, um, so everything is better about it. it. It just behaves so well in the corner. I mean, it's just uh, <laughs> pretty unbelievable. Yeah, I mean they are tough competitors. We know that. I mean uh, that the, the ALMS championship is our focus. Uh, we made that pretty clear from the beginning. Um, we came close now a couple of a couple of times, so we really want to make sure we uh, we get everything out of it and and win the championship. That's our goal. I mean, uh, uh, it's it's fierce competition, hard competition, and we know they'll be up to the, the standards which we expect them to be. Um, so we have to give it our best shot, and uh, we'll stay very focused and and and, and you know stay very um, determined to our goals. And, um, you know, especially the first race, Sebring, which is together with the WEC championship, uh, there will be a lot more cars in a, in, a, in a hell of a field. So it's going to be very important to um, look at the 12-hour race at one side, but also obviously, um, you know, keep the points and keep the championship in mind. Although I don't want to talk too much about that at the moment. We're just having fun driving the car. <laughs> <laughs>